We're back on Access Carolina and throughout this week we have featured great family events and activities for St. Patrick's Day. Great picks for a culinary experience of the Irish tradition and today Sam Slatter's here. So we're highlighting some places to revel. Happy almost St. Patrick's Happy Day. Happy almost St. Patrick's Top Day. Top of the everything. Top, Top of the morning. The morning. Um, what does it take to be a great St. Patrick's Day pub to you? I think um, beer and whiskey. Mm -hmm. I think it's a very simple um, I mean, having spent time in Ireland, beer plus whiskey equals fun time. Yeah, it's, um, it's as a long formula. as you're doing it safely, of course. Do it safely, and so there's a lot of places you could have picked, but you went through and you and you picked out some spots that you yeah. thought were extra special. First, you said Delaney's Irish Pub in downtown Spartanburg. What makes yeah. it great? So not only is it like the Irish Pub in downtown Spartanburg, but they've got shenanigans on the square tomorrow, and so they'll have live music inside and outside. Um, and just a very revel, revelrous, I think that's yeah, the word, revelrous, revelrous mm -hmm. environment. Um, and then also, if you walk just a block and a half down at the freight yard, they will also be doing some shenanigans under a different name. Um, I saw this morning that they're doing an Irish Spring uh, whittling contest. <laughs> I like that. Um, so it's, if you get to Delaney's, you can have a nice, uh, you know, a pint of Guinness or a shot of Jameson or something like that, and then just kind of enjoy the atmosphere of revelry. I love that, and and we all love the shenanigans. Remind me yes. next year, and we'll have to whittle a bar of Irish Spring. Yes. I'm interested um, in that too. Yes, I uh, yes. Okay, make a note. The official St. Patrick's Day bar crawl and party, speaking of shenanigans yes. happening, will be this Saturday in Greenville. Tell us about that one. So if you're in Greenville and you're downtown and you want. Uh, something to do that is St. Patrick's Day oriented. Maybe uh, you took the kids to the parade or the party earlier and then they've got a babysitter or Aww, you don't have kids and you just want to go out and see the town. Uh, the, the bar crawl, it's all through downtown, you know, a lot of the, the usual suspects are in there and so you can yeah. stop in and get different drink specials or, um, yeah. They're all on screen, all those spots along the way. Just keep you going for one place. Now, that kind of reminds you, there's so many places to check out. Yeah. Just go along on that pub Uber crawl. Uber downtown, start at the top of yeah. uh, Main Street and just work your way down. Shamrock pub crawl, sure to have a lot of shenanigans. And then over at Hampton Station, mm -hmm. they are very good at celebrating all the things. Yeah. Tell us about the festivities they've got planned. They've got, I think, uh, craft axe throwing is really the ones that are, are, are holding it down this year. They've got some specials going on, but then they'll just have, they'll have live music. There, there's going to be, I mean, obviously that big space, plenty of uh, space for the kids to hang out uh, while enjoying. I mean, uh, I think we talked about it over uh, about Halloween. We talked about Hampton Station, where they, they really go big with all the different uh, restaurants and different vendors there. So, a lot of new things have opened up. You can check out some of the new new spots and uh, just enjoy. Not downtown. Will you be pinched for not wearing green? Do they still do that? I think so. Okay. Depends I'm not sure around. what what the, the rule is on that in 2024. You. Okay, well, well, probably not. I mean, if we're being honest, probably not. All right. Well, yeah. you, you're safe to go have fun, but wear the green anyway, just because yeah. it's it's better. Thank it, you for that. It looks good Sam. on people. Oh, well, great, Sam. Thank you very much. Yes. Sam, of course, the author of Are You Afraid of the Dark Rum and other cocktails for 90s kids. Anybody watching wants to visit Sam's website. Follow him on social media. For